Hi friends, this is Pastor Lucas Finn and this is our snack for the journey and we are here starting another week and we're still in the book of Ecclesiastes, a beautiful book. I'd like to encourage you to read the whole book. It's a great book. It's, it's a book that is Solomon talking. It's a, it's a wise man looking at this world and what he sees and his uh, 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 attempt to fulfill his uh, emptiness and it's 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 great at, at least and at the same time sad to see his uh, the struggle that he goes through life being a very wise man powerful man rich he has everything and at the same time he said everything is run after the will the wind it, we, it cannot fuse its emptiness the emptiness is it's, it's too big so we see this and, and then he is in the middle of the whole thing he gives kind of advice for us to how we can manage this kind of situation and today I'm going to share with you a, a very important verse but before I do that I'd like to to encourage you to share this video with your friends and families and subscribe to our channel and help us to bless other people. The verse for today is chapter 7, chapter 7, verse 5. five. Look what uh, Solomon wrote. It is better to heed a wise man's rebuke than to listen to the song of fools. And it's, the, the comparison here is very, is very clear. You have the option. What do you prefer to, to, to listen to music, even if it is a like full, stupid, crazy music, or to listen to a wise man rebuke you? Normally, normally we go with the music. We don't want to be rebuked. We don't want anybody to say to us what we're doing wrong in our lives and why we're, we're not getting where we want to be and all that kind. We don't want to hear that. We prefer to see and watch. This is why people are not TikTok, and Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, whatever. They want to be there, to be entertained, to watch movies and all that kind of thing. I don't want to. I don't want to people telling me what is wrong with me. I don't want that. But Solomon says, look, it's better. It's better to hear the rebuke of a wise man, someone that is good, someone that understands life, someone that walks with the Lord. It's better to heed, to pay attention to what they have to say than to go after all the other entertainment aspects of life and just kind of kill time and, and do things that is not important. Pay attention. It's better to pay attention. Even if it is going to hurt a little bit, pay attention is much better. It's much better. And this is a great, great wisdom for each one of us because we are living in a world full of entertainment, distraction. But we need wise people. We need to hear what the wise people have to say to us. Even if it is hard, we have to. And this is our snack for today. God bless you.